This is my last vlog with big hair. Sad day. Hey guys, I'm Akazeli. I have changed locations once again because it's really hot in my room and I don't think you guys want to see a five minute video of me just sweating to death. So I'm here in my living room. A few days ago, I saw a documentary on Netflix entitled Mortified Nation where it's a bunch of adults reading journals from their earlier years and I thought it was a really cool idea. I decided I wanted to do the same thing, but the problem was I don't have a journal. So I went rummaging in my closet and I found the next best thing, which is this. That's right, I have a published book. It's titled My Worst Crossed Out Best Life because I thought I was being cool. Because nothing else is cooler than crossing out the word worse and putting best on top. I don't know. Well, it's not really a published book. It's more like a journal that my teacher published for us so we can keep it for later years. And I found it and now I shall read it for you guys. I don't really know what to title this video. I guess we can call it My Mortified Nation or Mortified Nation Challenge or Read My Journal or one of those three. I don't know. So shall we start this embarrassment? We shall. I have never read this book or seen it in years. So my reactions you're gonna see are actually real reactions. Oh, look at his little me, aww. Look at how hideous I was. I was an ugly child, I'm not even gonna joke. So here we go, first page. The first chapter is entitled Forward, but I spelled forward wrong. I mean, my writing looks really good for a second grader, but then there's the picture. What the hell is this? Do you see it? I'm guessing it's supposed to be me, but why am I a box? It looks as if I'm sticking out my tongue on the side of my cheek and my Tongue says hi on it. Then I have some weird mustache going across my nose. Second grade me really has some talent, didn't he? Hi, my name is Makazeli, and you're going to learn about the passion in my life. Because there's passion in my life. Look at second grade me using all these big words like passion. Oh my gosh, I was just ahead of my time. I'm writing this book because my teacher assigned it to me. There we go. I've always been the type of person that just tells it how it is. I do not fluff. My teacher assigned me to write this, so now I'm going to write this. I think the reader shall read my book because they would get some ideas to write their own book. I don't think anybody's gonna get ideas to write their own book off of this book. In chapter one, you will learn about my mom. I chapter Tao, you will learn about my younger years. I chapter Tao, just let that sink in. I wrote in chapter one right the first time, but then in chapter two, I decided to mess up. I don't even know, I probably took two shots of whiskey or something, I don't know. I chapter Tao just happens. In chapter three, I wrote in. You will learn about my school. In chapter four, there we go, and it's written correctly. You will learn about my family. In chapter five, you will learn about my five or eat. Things. Oh my gosh. In chapter six, you will learn about my fun tune. What? I started off this chapter really great with the passion and all, but then it just was a slow decline from that. I couldn't even spell in right. Like, come on, what's wrong with me? This next chapter is entitled My Mom. And to second grade me, I'm guessing nothing else could describe my mom than a purple triangle with a face on top. Like, I feel like I didn't even try with the drawings. Like, really? When my mom was young, she lived in Compton. There I go again, just telling it like it is. Compton is a city with many schools and parks, but had some gamings and bad things. You know, Compton is just a beautiful city with all those schools and parks, but then those gamings, you know, those gamings just ruin everything. When she moved, she was in kindergarten, so she had to Kange schools. Kange. My mom dreamed about writing songs. She has been writing songs, but she is not a singer. Wow. Around the time of my birth, my mom remembers I didn't want to come out of her stomach. That involves vaginas. What is wrong with me? Second grade, Makazeli was a party. He did not have a filter. What happened to me? There was a lot of excitement because I was five weeks early. I think being five weeks early is quite a bad thing. I don't really think there was much excitement. I think there was much panic. My mom said I was a cut quiet and a goo baby. I can't. I just can't. This next chapter is entitled The Younger Years because supposedly there was younger years than that. There goes the purple triangle again. When I was two, I spelled two correctly this time, I ran to my sister's school. My mom thought I got lost so she started started crying. I said started twice. Then she took me home and I started crying. I'm guessing there was a lot of crying in my younger years. When I was one, I learned 
my first word, no. I don't even think I have to explain this one. I was saying that word a lot of times, maybe too much, that my mom got tired. She was going crazy. Okay. This next chapter is entitled School Days. And there goes that box again. I don't know what it says in the speech bubble. I think it says wow. I don't know what wow means. I don't know what's wrong with me. I was a special child. I'm still in fourth grade at Carpenter. Are you serious? You're telling me I wrote this in fourth grade, not second grade. What is wrong with me? Like, comment, share, and subscribe, babe. Bye!